Rocky broke. Glenn oh, had the no. other one. Oh, I'm sorry. Thanks. I know I need to Can't say it's not a walkie-talkie and all that. Sad. She I know wants, it doesn't she knows, make any she connects sense, that to her but it's family. how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find oh, you another. Clementine. I'll just keep this one, I guess. The broken Lee, one. come here for a second. Hmm. Let me go deal with this. Oh, man. <laughs> Let me go deal with this. Freaking duck. You, you like my daughter? Yeah, she's great. Well, stay the fuck away from her. Or Jesus. What? Or uh, everyone will know that you, Lee Everett, are a killer. And you were before it was something you had to do to stay alive. I know who you are. And I don't give a shit this about guy. what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. You're a dick, man. I hope I hope some zombie hey, gets... I, no, I shouldn't have not got those pills. Second? Asshole. Don't stare at me. My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. That's right. That guy Doug is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. Uh, I'm only one to have man. Wait, oh yeah. This I hope like that's the sound of us moment. winning this thing. Me too. This motor end's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree oh, with that plan. Me too. Our first we got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. There are worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. Home base, you know, baby. Guys, I think it's going to be okay. It's gonna be okay, don't worry. Oh, never mind. No power. And that's how. You bastard. Well, we actually beat the first episode in a night. Next time on The Walking Dead. I thought we'd be fine if we survived the walkers. Never expected they'd starve us out. No food. I Clementine want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. You don't know me anything, Carly. How you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy. I'm Andrew oh, St. John. New people. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. Oh, gosh. I never did thank you for saving Duck from the walkers back at Herschel's farm. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a Oh, God. Is she gonna like... The walkers don't worry me as much as the You fuck with us! Now we're gonna take what we want! There's too many of them! Yeah! Oh, God. I don't like it. Next episode, it's not. No more, oh I want to just keep playing. No now. more, please. Please, please. Who was that? Oh man, this is gonna be a good series. Oh man. Oh, oh. Click that. Oh man, that was really, really good. No doubt about it. Like I, I keep saying it over and over, but it's got had the person-to-person -person thing. You know, it's about the people. Had some actually really cool tense moments. You know, the taking out the zombies one by one um, when they were attacking, and and the way they they implemented the point-click in this to kind of make it action-based. You know, you're moving around, you're attacking the zombies good stuff I kept talking about how much I like the animation and the character design and all that mixing the comic book style and 3d style 3d style yeah but yeah just good great stuff all around voice acting was pretty solid there was a few yeah, a few voice actors here and there but it seems like the main cast is pretty solid um, the, the dynamic between the 
this little girl you just meet in a, in a treehouse and this murderer guy. That, that's that's going to be fun to watch um, kind of unfold as we go on with, uh, um, with that guy knowing and then apparently her getting angry that the Kelly? Yeah, Kelly getting angry that you don't support her dad even though he knocks you out and leaves you for dead. And Herschel hates me, so, you know, you know, ain't no thing, ain't no thing. But, yeah, loved this first episode, cannot wait for the second episode. Tell Telltale Games... One of my favorite developers. I love point-and-click adventure games. It, that's the one thing, I guess, it was a bit... It wasn't like I had trouble getting through the game, necessarily. But... But it was... It was fun. Like, I didn't... That didn't hold me back from enjoying it, because the story was so solid, and the pacing was, you know, from the moments of calm to the tense moments right away. And, and the way they did it, I was just kind of enjoying the clever way they made the point-and-click work in a game about zombie killing, you know? And it's not about zombie killing, but the way they made it work with that dynamic was really, really, really neat. Uh, I can't say it again. I can't say it more than, you know, I've already already have. This, I've, the, the early reviews say this is the best Telltale game so far, and... I agree. I really liked the Back to the Future series just because I was a big fan of Back to the Future, and I'm a big fan of The Walking Dead, and just the way they they kind of made it more accessible in terms of in terms of uh, the way the game plays, and just the dialogue choice, the 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 way you have to do them really quickly. Usually, in like games like Mass Effect or things like that, when you have to make those decisions, you just kind of you can just kind of sit there and oh, let me break down every single choice I have and. Let me just let me just pick one, you know, pick the one that comes out the best, or comes out with the best option. And there's a few times there, or if you when you were watching, you know, the the timer got really. I got I, I I had to make a quick decision because, you know, I wasn't sure exactly what what I what 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 to say. And and that that's a sign of a good good game. It's when you you're actually thinking about it and and just. Uh, one of the big things I heard about the game a lot too was when it was being um, promoted was the whole um, this game does a lot of things that you you kind of gonna cringe at and it wasn't necessarily like the zombie kills there was some some pretty crazy ones where the first one you just bash this well you shoot the guy in the head and then right after that you bash this um, chick in the head with a hammer and you just click 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 and it's pretty it gets pretty intense um but I think the most shocking thing was what you know having to watch that that chick shoot herself. That was that was actually pretty pretty intense. And yeah, I I can talk about this game all day. I'm, I might do a, like a podcast or something. But I really liked it. I'm, I'm probably gonna try and write something up for themoderngamer.com. Go visit themoderngamer.com. But yeah, really enjoyed it. Can't wait for episode two. I hope you enjoyed watching me play this game and there was a few times in there that I kind of got quiet but that's because you know I was enjoying the the character speaking and just <laughs> trying to absorb it and be able to deliver the best bullet the best option uh, best uh, dialogue options and all that stuff so yeah I hope you enjoyed it uh, go to the moderngamer.com for you know I'm probably gonna review this write about this maybe check out check out some of our articles and yeah Hope you enjoyed that. Alrighty. Goodbye. Good goodbye. Goodbye. Oh, I can't. I can't. This is not good.